dear students today i am going to show you how to register nptel course and how to set the mentor for your course just to open your browser and type nptel swayam and open that link online courses.nptel.ac.in and in the previous video i elaborately explained how to choose your course and what's the procedure to get your certificate in my previous video and this video i am going to show you how to register or how to sign up your nptel portal and how to choose your uh, the courses that are relevant to your discipline or relevant to your interest so here this is the login page uh, already i have that uh, account in nptel so it's uh, by default it shows the user i username and password if you don't have that uh, mail id either you can use the, these three options if you have microsoft account or google account or facebook account as a newcomer you can choose any one of the option directly you can sign up into that page or else even though you not prefer these three one and if you are new to that the nptel swim and you like to register as a new account just you click the sign up now and it's it, it asking only few details for example username and password confirm password and it's a valid email id to get your verification code use your valid email id and click send verification code now just you open your mail id and you will get that the verification code and just you copy it and paste it in the login page and verify that code okay it's validated and click the create button right so here successfully we registered that uh, nptl swm portal that login is created it shows that a uh, dr k sudha at gmail.com so once you created successfully so your login by default it's come to into this place right so next one just you go to that all courses even you can uh, already decide the course which you are going to prefer directly type the name of your course today i am going to type uh, google cloud that is a uh, google cloud computing foundation just you click that course details and click the join here this is the important page you have to type all your details that uh, details it will be reflected in your uh, certificate also so type carefully that name and mobile number valid email id it's already exist here and uh, the age group select the gender and uh, the resident it's india pin code so give your valid or uh, the details in all the places yes once you enter the pin code and by default it takes the the state and the uh, city and the profession it's a faculty highest qualification if you are as a student just you can choose any one of the the information which is relevant to you or 
uh, as a faculty i am going to choose the highest qualification is doctoral degree and year of graduation even as uh, the students who is studying that college either first year or second year just you can choose that course relevant to your highest uh, qualification and you can match with that the year of graduations so that's fine and uh, here this is the next important thing academic uh, bank of credits that's a abc account if you have that abc id just you can uh, use i have abc id or else you can choose allow swayan to create abc id even you don't need abc id just you click the third one so just now i am going to choose the second one allow swayan to create the abc id and the students most of the students you are having the abc id if if you have abc id just you can uh, use that id it's fine and uh, coming to the educational details the part of swiam local chapter so here for example in your uh, college or university uh, if you are having the nptel swiam local chapter just you prefer yes you don't have the uh, local chapter just you can choose no so for our university we are having the swiam local chapter just i am going to choose yes and the next one a uh, local chapter state it's a tamil nadu and college it's a srm university so here you have to choose your uh, either college or uh, that university name correctly so if you missed something if you chosen wrongly so it will be reflected your profile page and it will be reflected all the the upcoming uh, the examinations what you are going to appear for nptel exam so this page especially for to register your course it's very very careful you have to be conscious when you are entering the details next one you have to choose the area or uh, just to look at that uh, engineering medical dental arts and humanities just i am going to choose a uh, science and from that science it's a uh, computer science it's my department even you can choose either information technology data science or which one it's relevant to you you can choose relevant courses and at last just you agree that uh, swiam terms and conditions and use the agree to follow the on a code so just you click on save before that i will check once again if all the details is correct just you can click the save button okay so now we successfully registered our google cloud computing foundation course so it the message it shows that thank you for registering the course and uh, click here the announcement tab for the important information uh, that is uh, the assignments and exam registration all the informations it will be displayed in the announcement page so this is the announcement announcement page it's a uh, displayed here this page all the information is available the nptel exam registration is open uh, and when the exam a uh, day october 29 2023 and uh, when you have to register your examination that's the last date of your exam registration it's a displayed here hall ticket and data charge whatever the information related to your exam all the information which is available here right just you can take from bottom to top so that information which it will be displayed in the order okay right now just you can look at that the remaining informations so this is the announcement page and coming to that about course so this page i shown in my previous video the summary of your course the preview of your video lecture and uh, the course layout uh, course instructor biography so the procedure to get your certificate all the informations which is available even before register your course you can check all the details and get clear idea about uh, the course which you are going to choose then you register the course that's fine uh, now just i am going 
to click go to courses and if you have any questions just you can raise it so the once this is the next important uh, the tab which is called as progress so once if the assignment is released every week you are going to submit your assignment then meantime maybe after few days after submitting your assignment you will get the result of your uh, exam right so that information which is displayed in the progress tab maybe after submitting i think uh, three or four days uh, you will get that assignment result either week 0 week 1 week 2 week 3 all the information the progress it will be uh, displayed on how much mark you secure that information which is displayed in the progress tab and even you can uh, that is uh, use the review if you are reviewing your assignment uh, just uh, this information is by default uh, there is no peer assignments it's available for review process and coming to this mentor so this is the next important part as a college students or university students you successfully registered your course and your faculties or your concern or the uh, course coordinator is instructing you to set your mentor here just you go to the mentor option and here click the people who is registered already the same google cloud computing foundation course and they are acting as a mentor so few uh, that is the names which is displayed here even this is my one more mail id just i register the course uh, the last week so just you click that the mail id and you click the set mentor yes now you are currently selected the mentor it's uh, the mail id it's shown here if you don't want to oh, set that mentor just you can click that uh, remove mentor and it automatically removed from that the web page or your uh, profile page or else if you want to change another name just you can use it as per your wish so this is the simplest way you can uh, create your account in nptl and you can choose your course and uh, register that course carefully and once a successful successful registration you can select your mentor and that the process is over now so once if that course is started and every week you are going to get that assignment in that meantime you have to focus on every week you have to focus on that uh, the video lecture it is displayed in your nptl portal just you look at uh, that uh, videos lecture materials which is uh, available in your login you go through all the informations and you submit that assignment on time so once the successful assignment completion that marks as well as your proctored marks it will be considered for your final scores i hope this video is helpful for everyone and thank you thanks for watching